good day. This is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news, and reviews. Okay, by request, we are going to have a demo of the complete setup of the High Watch Pro application. And we have here our smartwatch. Okay, this is this is the device that we are going to pair with the high watch pro application and this is on the android platform so if you have any questions regarding the setup of the high watch pro on android platform just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if you do have that time okay let's start again this smartwatch is using the high watch pro application so we have here the qr code it's available here uh, in this smartwatch you can scan this and download the app and of course pair it with a smartwatch or you can use the user manual or just search the application here on google play high watch pro so we have here the application high watch pro with over 10 million plus downloads it is a very popular application and it is also lightweight having 43 MB only, less than 50 MB in size. Okay, so let's download and install the application. Again, we did not scan the QR code here. Instead, we just search it on Google Play Store. Still the same. Okay, I find it more easy and fast to just to just search it here on Google Play Store instead of scanning the QR code. Okay, we are almost done. Okay, we're done in downloading. It's now installing the application. Again, this is a complete setup from notifications, watch face to the setup of the uh, Bluetooth call. Okay, so let's open the app. I watch pro device disconnected so let's wait for it to load so this is just an ad we have here on top continue to app so we have here our first permission allow high watch pro to access this device's location while using the app so we have here the UI of the high watch pro we have the home set motion and mine mine is for your profile another permission here just allow it motion is for, is for your sports set is for your smartwatch and a home it is where the automatic activity tracking as well as other health and sports function will show okay let's go to the set so bluetooth pairing quest we'll cancel it cancel it first so let's go to set so we have here the UI bind devices to experience more features did we activate our Bluetooth it's not it is not yet activated let's see if the application will activate the Bluetooth connectivity to pair your smartwatch just tap on bind devices to experience more features Okay, open location service location information we'll activate this is our GPS here go back tap in again okay it's already activated our Bluetooth here the app automatically activated our Bluetooth connectivity so we have here our smartwatch is this our smartwatch the T900 Ultra let's check go to the settings of our, our smartwatch more select about and we have here our mac address so it is our smartwatch 1f2d so tap on the t900 ultra the app will try to connect with the smartwatch bluetooth base connection completed time setting completed and I guess we are now paired 
with our smartwatch. So as you can see here, we have the smartwatch here and the version. So let's check if we are really paired with the smartwatch find and we have it here. Then next, let's go first with our first feature here. We have the message push. Tap on it. Let's see if it will ask for permission. So let's activate the color minder. We have here a permission for phone book, address book, and call record. Agree. Allow High Watch Pro to access your phone call logs. Allow. Allow High Watch Pro to access your contacts. Allow it. And make and manage phone calls. It's now activating. Set successfully. The next SMS. Okay. So agree. Then allow to send and view SMS messages. It's now committing. Then for our application notifications. So we have activated it here. So open. Look for the High Watch Pro. Allow for notification access. Then you can select some of the apps here. Okay, Instagram, committing. Okay, so we are done with the application as well as the SMS. So we are done or we are finished setting up the message push notifications. For frequent contacts, you can add it here on your smartwatch. So let's see if we have one. None. Tap on frequent contacts. Okay, so we have no contacts here. We can add one. Okay, you can add, manually add the nickname as well as the number or you can go to the phone book. Okay, for example, we have it here. Then, okay. So, we have here the frequent contacts set successfully. Let's check. Phone book and we have here our contacts. So, we are done with adding a contact on our smartwatch. Next. Other settings here, let's check if we have some other, other settings to set. Mine. Okay, you can set the steps. Distance here. Set, let's check. Privacy settings. Sedentary. I guess that's it. Okay, next. How can we add or download the watch face? Okay, so let's go with the dial settings. So we have here some available watch faces in our dial management section. Okay, to download the watch face, just tap on it. It's now loading. Kindly reminder, the dial upgrade process in order. Okay, got it. And it will automatically download the watch face. And your smartwatch will set automatically change to the download mode as you can see here. So let's wait for it to finish. 11%, 12. Okay, it's almost finished here as you can see. 98%, 99 and done. Okay, our smartwatch restarted and we have here our downloaded watch face. Okay, for the custom dial or custom wallpaper, so we have it here, just pick one. Okay, we'll select this one on the bottom part. Tap on install. Let's see if we can change the design. Okay, so let's select our background so we have here a permission to access your gallery just allow it so let's pick one so let's select this one no nope. how about this one okay check so you can select the location here so we'll leave it as it is, then tap on install. So let's wait for it.
Okay, did not work. Let's check. Okay, got it. Okay, that's it. Okay, let's wait for it to finish downloading. Similar to the previous watch face that we downloaded, it also worked that way. Okay, just tap on install and your smartwatch will automatically set to download mode. So let's wait. Okay, as you can see here, we are almost finished. Let's see if we can. Okay, our smartwatch is started. And here is our custom wallpaper. So that's it for the dials or the wallpaper for our smartwatch. So we are done with the setup for our smartwatch. For the Bluetooth call, all you have to do just to make it sure that your settings is properly or your smartwatch is properly connected when it comes to Bluetooth call, tap on the Bluetooth. Okay, we have here the T900 Ultra. Tap on this one. It's now pairing. Okay, so Bluetooth pairing quest, pair it. This is for the calls and the music control. Okay, just activate this one. Make it sure that you activate this one to receive or to activate the Bluetooth call. You are paired with the smartwatch, but when this one is not activated, you will not be able to have a Bluetooth call on your smartwatch. So that's it for the complete setup of your wearable to the HiWatch Pro application. In our case, it is the T900 Ultra smartwatch. So if you have any questions regarding the complete setup of the HiWatch Pro application on Android, just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if you do have the time. Bye!